I had someone ask me the other day how to do this combo. So, um, this one, <laughs> this one. Because it is, it's really good. I don't usually do it in matches because I don't find it stable enough, even though I'm looking, looking like the only reason I dropped it just then was because of butterflies. But really, the tricks are, you need the off axis to the right. I will want to change this. <laughs> I love the name. Thank you for the follow. Um, one of the tricks is you have to be off axis to the right, of course, which means off launches such as back one plus four, down four two, um, down back three plus four, you need to already be off axis before you start because you won't have time to recover. Off um, lot of counter hit moves, you're either already off axis or you can well, if you can't those, you're already off axis, you might be able to step in the right position. Some of them you can't. Like, um, this one you can No, that one you can. What is it? It's, um, this one. That one you can't. So, with this one, with upward 2 one, it's probably the most stable way to do it, because you're already on axis. And side step 2, side step right 2 can also work. But yeah, you need to be off axis to the right. Then you also need to do the quarter circle forward ones. Pretty much as quickly as you can. Yeah. Um, and then the butterfly. So if you notice when I'm doing the butterfly, I'm not doing, I'm not delaying it at all. So it kind of, if you look, I just did the quarter circle once. It looks like she's too far away. It looks like the butterfly's not going to connect. So a lot of people think that you have to sort of delay it a little bit. But if you delay it a little bit, it's not going to reach. It actually reaches further than you realize. Oh. I thought I dropped it. Yeah. So it's really it's the size it right. Do it as quick do it as quickly as you can. That's honestly the trick. I feel like that's such a cliche bit of advice. See then like I had a bit too much of a delay between the quarter circle forward ones. That's how I was too far off access to do that. Yeah. So that's the trick, really. <laughs> I find it such a, a silly trick to say in any fighting game. It's do it as quickly as you can. But a lot of the time, it rings true for combos. You do it as quickly as you can. Um, quickly as you can in Tekken terms, though, is a little bit different, I suppose. If not, you do the buttons quickly, like, as fast as possible. It's a, you do it as soon as you're out of recovery. So if I've got the hits done there. Well, the head's done, all the block's done. You can see Nina doesn't recover until a little while after. So I'm just trying to do it as soon as she's out of recovery. That's the trick. Oh, so if you if you have it so you display and you can see the colours, you can see when that's the case. And not too slow. Yeah, you get the idea. Oh my god. Now I'm struggling. I'm nervous. It's a bit weird. Well, I find it a little bit weird having this done on. It's like something else to look at. But yeah. <laughs> so, that's it really. It's just you do it as quickly as you can. There's no little delay. There's no real trick except for being off axis and then doing the move as quickly in succession as the game will allow you. Yeah.